Five 100 committee, of which I am a member, uh, was impressed with the potential of this university to do globally excellent work and in, is encouraging the university to propose innovative and interesting programs. So we hope, well I'm speaking only for myself, I hope, because I have a lot of confidence in this university, uh, that it will be very useful in, in terms of the, the uh, programs it's proposing. I think the 5100 program is maybe a little bit too narrow in encouraging the, mainly the sciences and other more traditional academic areas. And I think that this particular university has a very long and distinguished tradition uh, working on international issues of a broader sort. And I hope that it will be possible for those programs to be put forward and to get at least some consideration um, by the 5100 uh, committee. Because I think th this university is really pioneering in Russia, even globally, in that area of international relationships. And especially working in developing and emerging economies for a very long period of time, which I believe is still exceedingly important. Knowledge is a global product in the sense that it emerges uh, from a whole variety of different countries and different institutions, and it's used all around the world. It doesn't stay in one country anymore. Uh, and countries and institutions which are leading institutions in the world increasingly are glo looking globally all over the place for what's the best knowledge and so on. And I think it's a challenge for Russian universities, all Russian universities, um, to make sure that the rest of the world understands that there's interesting things going on in this country and are, uh, which are globally relevant and worthwhile. I think I said that the Trinity, the most important elements are good governance, that is how the university is organized and managed, top talent, that is really smart students and faculty members, and making sure they're selected on a meritocratic basis, and they're treated well, that is the faculty are paid properly, they're not teaching too much, and so on. Uh, and the third, the third part of it is, um, what did I say? Um, uh, uh, yes, resources, abundant resources. One does need money for all this. And that's one of the reasons that the 5100 program exists, to give the best Russian universities some extra funding so that they can do these uh, programs effectively. Um, so if you have these three elements, it really helps a lot. And if you don't have those three elements together, you have a big problem. Mm -hmm.